What's going on guys, it's Rexy Gaming here and welcome back to another LSPDFR episode. Today we are going to be in this um, 2016 Ram 2500. This is part of Allen's um, Vinewood Hills Police Department pack including the Federal Signal Valor light bar included on this pack. So let's go ahead and take a look at the vehicle before we begin this episode. As you can see, we got this uh, West End push bumper with side LEDs. And it's got some extra grills on that bumper too, which I like that. We got two LEDs. And, and uh, between that we got the Federal Signal Siren Speaker. We got two red and blue LEDs on the dash cam. The Federal Signal Extreme. We got two LED spotlights. We got the Federal Signal Valor light bar included with the ALPRs. On the back we got eight LEDs on the back windshield. And we got LEDs by the license plate. And let's take a look at the interior of that car before we begin this episode. We got the stalker radar system, police laptop, and we got a nice partition included with the um, carbine rifle and the shotgun stored in there. Pretty nice look. And the hands on the steering wheel don't line up correctly, so and let's take a look at the lighting. So stage one is the traffic advisor. And if we look at it, that's uh, reflecting on the wall. That's the red and blues that's being shown. Stage two is the half lights. And stage three. Take a look at that pattern of the lights. You can see the tail lights are strobing. And uh, the headlights are not strobing. But you can see we got red and blues going on on the push bumper. And the Federal Signal Valor light bar patterns going on too. This lighting on that Ram 2500 truck looks very amazing. And there you have it. So the lights on this truck look very impressive. So let's take a look at if we have cruise lights. We do have cruise lights. And let's see if we have takedowns. Yep, we do have takedowns. Uh, the front of the Valor light bar and the two spotlights if we need additional lighting. So today we're going to be doing a nighttime patrol. And we're going to be with the Los Santos Port Police. So as you can see on this uniform. It says Port of Los Santos Police. I don't think we have not done a nighttime patrol in a while. And I think uh, this should look uh, pretty nice for this episode. So let's go ahead and get started. Dispatch, show me 1041 10 8. Dispatch, show me on patrol, available for calls at 19 Buccaneer Way. Roger, Ocean 128. Show me en route. 10-4, copy, Ocean 128. We have Melissa's vehicle damage. Show me code 4. Attention all 
We have Melissa's vehicle damage. Show me in route. All right, we got a road rage that a caller reports a road rage incident. Suspect is damaging their vehicle. So it's going to be in terminal. Officer, that person right there just damaged my vehicle. Oh, we got a person running. One in the vehicle. Dispatch, show me in pursuit of one running. Um, 19 northbound Buccaneer Way. Be advised, suspect just 1050 into a barrier wall. Requesting air unit. Try to pit him. Did not work. So the suspect just flee in a vehicle. Oh, he's just losing control a little bit. Let me pit him. Pit work. Driver, get out of the vehicle. Out of the vehicle. Dispatch, uh, stop traffic. Attention all units, officer requesting traffic control near terminal. Oh, he's holding something in there. Roger that. What's your name, sir? Attention all units, near code 4. Kakasoto Shiguru, license valid, no active warrants. License a uh, suspended no active warrants. All right, sir. We got a call about you uh, that you uh, damage uh, um, that you uh, damaged uh, their vehicle. So it's a road rage. So. Um, so. Um, and also I can tell that your license has been a suspended so why are you driving this car with a with a, a suspended license it was an emergency I needed uh, to visit the hospital well I get that uh, but you shouldn't uh, be driving uh, so so you're gonna be charged with that as well because uh, you're taking uh, their vehicle and I'm gonna have to do a play check on this Dispatch requesting uh, 1028. It's gonna be 89 Zebra X Ray Will um, Yang 649. Requesting play check. It's gonna be 89 Zebra X Ray Yang 649. Target vehicle license. Play eight niner zero x ray young six four niner. Angeline Lee. No flags on the vehicle and no flags on the owner. Okay, and let's go ahead and search his vehicle here that he was driving to flee from police. Firearm. All right, sir. Do you have anything legal on you? I need to know about. I'm always carrying something. Okay, well, I'm going to pat you down, man, but thank you for being honest. So let me pat you down. Ooh. I can tell that he's carrying something. He carried a red cardiac brandy bag containing a baggie of marijuana weighing less than 0 0.50 ounces. Let's go ahead and check on that. And I'm going to go ahead and 
grab this man and put him right in the back of my unit. We're going to try to see if the back door on this ram works. There we go. Now it worked. Alright, sit there watch your head, man. And I can tell that the engine is smoking, so we're going to call a tow truck. Dispatch request in tow truck. So today, he's going to be charged with aggravated fleeing to elude law enforcement officers. And then driving while suspended. And I forgot to check on the weapons here. So for the registered owner, it's valid. So he's going to be charged with suspended license, aggravated fleeing to elude law enforcement officers in the vehicle. And uh, he's done a little bit of reckless driving. And also he'd been uh, carjacking a vehicle during uh, the road rage incident. So it's going to be two felonies and, and two misdemeanor charges. Also, I forgot to charge him with marijuana. So it's this one. So about five charges. Three felonies and two misdemeanor charges. Dispatch requesting PT 14 Buccaneer Way, southbound. Assistance required on um, Buccaneer Way. All right, all is yours. Bitch. All right, well, off they go, so we'll be code four off that call and head back to Nate. Show me en route. Alright, we got a stolen police hardware that's in terminal and AMPR hit on vehicle suspected of carrying stolen police weapons. So we're gonna head there and respond code 3 over there. Oh, the suspect is heading towards our way here, so we're gonna have to go straight and to block uh, the suspect's vehicle. He's about to make a left here. Dispatch, be advised, I spotted a um, a red semi truck coming towards our way here. Can't four copy that. Is that a truck? Oh, it's a red car. Dispatch, be advised, I spotted a red and black um, muscle car 
eastbound Buccaneer Way. We're going to make a traffic stop on them. Shots fired, shots fired at an officer. 1 8 Buccaneer Way. He's getting back in our car. Hey. Hey, get out of the car. Hey, put your hands up, sir. Whatever you carry on your weapon that you have, drop that. Alright. Dispatch, stop traffic. 19 Buccaneer Way. Roger that. Suspect is under arrest for trying to assault an officer. Alright, sir, what's your name? Quentin Wiggins, license valid, no active warrants. Alright, sir, what were you doing? Why were you grabbing a, um,. Why were you grabbing uh, your assault rifle uh, and start uh, shooting at officers? It's none of your business. I understand that. I understand uh, your point. Um, but uh, we got a call about you saying uh, that you got a stolen uh, police weapon. So I just want to know that if you have anything that's illegal on you or, or in your car. Nothing legal on me. All right, well, one of our buddies is going to patch you down, okay? Sweet Jesus. Dispatch requesting play check. 44 Victor Charles Lincoln 270. Ooh, a counterfeit Ford Zancudo base ID. Play 44 Victor Charles Lincoln 270. Seb Butler, no flags on the vehicle and no flags on the owner. Ooh, a stolen police rifle. That's what I can tell. Dispatch, we have recovered a stolen police rifle on scene. We also recovered a stolen carbine rifle used in a shootout. Oh, that's what I can tell. You know, that suspect grabbed a stolen carbine rifle and started making a shootout with officers. But he puts back his weapon in his car, so... Today he's getting some serious charges. So today he's going to be charged with So he's going to be charged with um, fraudulent IDs, which he got on them. Um, the Ford Zancudo base ID, that's fraudulent. So it's a felony charge. And also the stolen police rifle that was used in a shootout. So it's going to be under firearms. It's going to be possession of a stolen firearm. So two felony charges. Dispatch requesting PT 19 Buccaneer Way. Assistance 
All right, Quentin. One of our officers is gonna um is gonna take you in uh, to jail. All right. Dispatch requesting 51 19 buck near way Dispatch requesting 51 for a blue sedan Requesting tow No, not FBI 2. Requesting tow. Tow truck. Assistance required in terminal. Alright, well off they go, so we'll be code 4 off that call and head back to Nate. Show me in route. Alright, we got a traffic break here at uh, Cypress Flats. We have an accident on the freeway, so it's just right outside of the port. Dispatch slow down traffic. Attention all units. Officer requesting traffic control near Cypress Flat. Attention all units. Traffic control clear. All right, there's the accident scene. Roger that. All units, we are code four. All right, well, I guess uh, that's an easy call, so we'll be code four and head back to Nate. Show me in route. Alright, we got an officer requesting assistance monitoring a bait car operation here in the terminal. So we're gonna head there. Or we'll just have to respond code to all all the way over there it's about 0 0.10 miles oh we're very close and let's turn off our lights here hello sir what's going on hey hope you're doing well as part of a new effort to reduce vehicle theft, we've decided to run a bait car setup in a high crime area. The bait car is parked down the street. Park your cruiser in a non nondescript a location in the view of the car. Sounds good. Hopefully we can catch some people. One more thing, if someone drives off, you can remotely switch the car off using Y. The car will have to move around 100 meters from the start point before you can shut the engine off. Find a suitable location.
You can also move the bait card to a better position before observing. Let's check to see where we can park our vehicle. Alright, uh, we'll just go ahead and park here. And we're going to go ahead and head back to my truck. All right. <clears throat> All right, so we're going to wait out here to check to see if anyone's going to come and uh, steal uh, this bait car. Alright, so uh, when we wait here a little bit longer, I didn't see anyone around here coming uh, to steal that big car, so we're going to be code 4 off that call, and that is going to end for today's Los Santos um, Port Police episode. I hope you did enjoy it. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you on the next one. Peace.